The darkness above your head is a measurement of time. Light has a finite speed. It travels about 300,000 kilometers every second, which we know from laboratory measurements and astronomical timing. A light year is the distance light travels in one year. So when we look at a star a thousand light years away, we see it as it was a thousand years ago, not as it is now. The part of the universe from which light has had time to reach us since the beginning of cosmic expansion is called the observable universe. Anything beyond that distance is simply unlit from our point of view because its light has not arrived yet. If the universe has only existed for a finite amount of time, then there's only a finite amount of space whose light can currently reach us, and that alone already chips away at the infinite sea of starlight that would otherwise make the sky blaze. Now comes an even trickier problem. Is the finite age of the universe enough on its own to keep the sky dark? Imagine shrinking the sun down to the size of a grain of sand and placing it in a football stadium 